welcome to Two Jews on Film. I'm Joan. And I'm John. Hi, John. Hi, John. And the film we're reviewing tonight is called The Mechanic. It stars Jason Stratham, uh, Stratham? Yeah, Stra whatever. Stratham, <laughs> Ben Foster, Tony Goldwyn, Donald Sutherland. It's actually a remake of the movie The Mechanic, which was done in the 70s with Charles Bronson. Okay, let's talk about this movie for a second, because I've got a lot of issues, a lot of moral issues. First of all... Moral? Well, I mean, you know, it's a very exceedingly violent film. You're using semi-automatic weapons. This guy shoots and kills at least 20 people at a time. There's a, <laughs> there's a, there's a sex scene where a guy goes in with these... He two, goes in, Jason. He, no, it wasn't Jason. What guy? It was his partner, the, that, with the, the, the big 6'7 guy. And there's, there's a, it's, it's an unbelievably brutal scene that starts out on a homosexual note and ends like, uh, like in, in a Vesuvius oh. of blood and violence. Oh, that scene, yeah. Then, then there's the, 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 the my, my favorite thing in this thing is like the two of them are sitting in the car one day and he says to his buddy, he says, They don't know who you mean. Ben Foster, who's his protege, okay. is sitting with him in the He's car. He's sitting there and he says, he says, so, so, do you ever feel remorse when you kill somebody? And the guy goes... <laughs> You know, and by and by that point, he's he you know, five, just five, go like five that. minutes. Five minutes later, he's shooting. It's amazing. No, 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 they're no. up against forty people. Bullets are coming everywhere, yeah, and they, they're, every time they shoot, <laughs> they hit three people with one bullet. You know, but the thing, the final thing is, is the 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 relationship that they have with women. I mean, the the messages that this gives that well, this he, movie he doesn't, gives to he kids. can't have a relationship with a woman know, because so of what he, he does. So he leaves her money and says. She says, what's your name? He uh -huh. says, take a guess. And she goes, Arthur. <laughs> could have been Arthur. But then he gives her a dog, which is well, very let's, sweet. Let's not tell, let's okay, not tell all the plot points of this okay, complex listen, movie. My big problem with this film is that it's absolutely unoriginal. This is a film you've seen a hundred thousand times. Know, Jason's a hitman, and he only kills bad people, and then he gets screwed, and it's a whole thing. But you know what? I've seen this. It's not original so if i left uh, an envelope of money at the edge of the bed i promise i won't ask you your name uh, yeah you know why because you spent it before i got it in the envelope well listen i think if you're a 15 16 17 year old boy you'll probably enjoy this film out of five bagels well i'm gonna give this i'm gonna give the mechanic two bagels because it really didn't do it for me one and a half dry dry why they got enough blood to <laughs> dip it in blood Anyway, it opens at theaters this Friday, and, you know, what can I say? Buckle your seatbelts. <laughs> Bye. Bye.